Hello po! Magandang hapon po sa lahat po ng ating mga viewers ngayong hapon na ito. Samahan niyo po ako muli sa 40 minutes na ating pagtuturo po dito sa ating Itulay Online Tutorial. But before that, no, uh, stay po tayo indoors ngayon no, kasi tag-ulan na, June, tag-ulan na po. So hindi ko sasabihin stay hydrated. So dapat stay indoors naman po tayo ngayon. Keep safe po mga listeners natin at ating mga viewers. Keep safe po. Huwag po tayong uh, mag-galak-galak muna ngayon. Uh, before that, gusto ko pong batiin ang aming SDS dito sa SDO po ng Oranga po City, si Madam Laydani Samson Pinanan. Ang aming ASDS po, si Madam Maydin Minimo, ang EPS po ng Araling Panipunan, si Madam Edwina Espiritu, at ang aming pong EPS po ng Edukasyon sa Pagpapakatao, si Madam Gina Bugay, at ang aking uh, school head po, Sir Samson S. Bukiron. Mag uh, magandang hapon po sa inyong lahat. Okay? At sa buong learners po natin, Maralusan Visayas, Mindanao, magandang hapon sa inyo, sa mga kapwa kuguro at sa mga parents po na nanonood po ngayon, gabayan po natin ang ating mga anak sa pag-aaral po natin ng Introduction to Philosophy of the Human Person na sa quarter 4 week 3 na po tayo at ang topic po natin ay Intersubjectivity or in short po, sa pinaka madali po natin maintindihan ay pakikipagkapatao. Intersubjectivity. Uh, nasa uh, Mo, uh, sa ating libro po, sa mga may hawak po ng learner's materials, uh, nasa lesson 6 po yan ang inyong uh, learning materials. Sa pivot modules po, ito po ay lesson module 2 po, quarter 4. Okay? So, ako po ang inyong tutor ngayong hapon na to, si Tutor Eresa. Uh, okay, ano po ang topic natin? No? Sa una is, we need to define intersubjectivity or pakikipagkapatao. We need to identify the similarities and differences of intersubjective concepts of the three philosophers, namely Confucius, si Martin Buber, and si Carol Gotila, and explore your intersubjective experiences and enhance your relations with people from all walks of life, especially the underprivileged and people with disability. Napakagali po ng topic natin. Napakaganda rin po ng topic natin na ito. At timely po siya ngayong panahon ng pandemia. Okay? So, Intro to Philosophy is a senior high school course subject. Lahat po tayo ng mga grade 11 and grade 12 ay pinagdadaanan po ang subject ito. Okay. So, ready na po kayo mga learners. If you are ready, get your module, your pivot modules. Kasi galing po ito sa ating pivot modules sa Deped Commons po. Makukuha niyo po ito sa Deped Commons. Presence of minds. And if you have comments and reactions, you can type it in the comment box. Okay. First and foremost, sabi nga sa module natin, no man is an island. Okay? Naniniwala po ba kayo dito that no man is an island? Hello to Natasha and Ella May Domingo. Naniniwala ba kayo that no man is an island? Okay? Actually, we usually hear this saying, no man is an island. There is no doubt naman that, that, that an average person understands this quotation. But despite the universal understanding that we have about it, we still express in various ways our beliefs on being with others. Kasi kailangan naman talaga natin ng ating kapwa-tao. Uh, mahirap mabuhay mag-isa, alam natin yan. No? Kaya nga, we need someone, we need partners, even uh, uh, even our kids, no? mahirap kapag sila lang mag-isa, kailangan niya ng kapatid, minsan naghahanap niya ng mga kalaro, so we need company, kailangan natin ng ating kapwa, kailangan natin ng others. So no man is living alone, no man is an island, sabi niya. No? At para mas mapalawag natin, maintindihan natin ng ating module, Nasa ating uh, tibot module din po ito. No? Uh, nandito yung isang magandang uh, passage sa Bible, a gospel po sa Bible, no? in a different version, pero itong version na ito, from New International Version, no? the parable of the Good Samaritan. Ito yung ginamit, isa sa mga ginamit sa module natin para mas ma uh, maintindihan natin no? uh, ano nga ba, uh, paano nga ba yung intersubjectivity na ginatawag o pakikipagkapatao. Okay, basahin ko po yung uh, parable of the Good Samaritan from Luke chapter 10 verses 25 to 37 from the international version book sabi on one occasion an expert in the law stood up to test Jesus teacher he asked what must I do to inherit eternal life so what is written in the law he replied how do you read it he answered Love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your strength and with all your mind. And love your neighbor as you love yourself. You have answered correctly, Jesus replied. Do this and you will live. 
But he wanted to justify himself, so he asked Jesus, And who is my neighbor? In reply, Jesus said, A man was going down from Jerusalem to Jericho when he was attacked by robbers. They stripped him of his clothes, beat him, and went away, leaving him half dead. A priest happened to be going down the same road. And when he saw the man, he passed by on the other side. So to a Levi, when he came to the place and saw him, passed by on the other side. But a Samaritan, as he traveled, came where the man was. And when he saw him, he took pity on him. He went to him and bandaged his wounds, pouring on oil and wine. Then he put the man on his own donkey, brought him to an inn, and took care of him. The next day, he took out two denarii two denari, denari, and gave them to the innkeeper. Look after him, he said, and when I return, I will reimburse you for any extra expense you may have. Which of these three do you think was a neighbor to the man who fell into the hands of robbers? The expert in the law replied, the one who had mercy on him. Jesus told him, go and do likewise. So, napakaganda po nung, nung passage nito, ng gospel nito sa ating Bible as sa pagpapaliwanag ng intersubjectivity no? sa ating mga mahawak ng modules nito. Sana uh, basahin natin na paulit-ulit itong passage nito para mas maitindihan natin ano ba ang nais sabihin ni Jesus Christ, ano ba ang nais niya uh, ipama- ipabalita o, ibig- o ipamahagi sa atin no? sa pagbibigay niya ng passage nito. And there are three questions in our modules, sabi niya. What virtue or virtues does the parable show? Give the instances where you see those virtues. What do you think is the reason why the good Samaritan helped the stranger despite their social differences? And if you are the Samaritan, would you do the same? So justify your answer. So our learners, so by ending the encounter in this manner, Jesus is telling us to follow the Samaritan's example in our own conduct. We have to show compassion and love for those we encounter in our everyday activities. We have to love our others, no? Our uh, regardless of their race or religion. So, what virtues do you see? Uh, being a good, uh, being good with our neighbors, love our uh, love, love our neighbors as we love ourselves. Is that uh, show compassion to our uh, to uh, to other people? So, is that sa mga virtues na makikita natin sa parable? So, what do you think is the reason, no? Actually, sabi nga, uh, we need to love others despite our, our differences. No? Kahit ano man ang race natin, ano man ang lahi natin, ano man ang religious natin, kailangan natin mahalangin ng ating kapatao. Hindi naman kasi uh, basihan sa pagkapatao yung mayaman ka, mayaman lang kayo. No? Kayo kayo lang mag-aksama. Mahirap sila, sila lang din. Ano mo yung, yung tropa na puro nakakulay black, sila sila lang din. Hindi ganun, no? Ang tamang pakipagkapatao, despite our differences in life, mayaman, mahirap, uh, may meron tayong kapinsanan o wala, o ma- um, nasa normal situations tayo, in any differences in our lives, no, we need to help our strangers, we need, we need to help other people. No? Kaya nga ngayon sa panahon ng pandemya, nakikita natin kung paano ba ang pakipagkapatao. Actually, makikita mo yun sa social media, no? sa Facebook pa lang, when you open your Facebook, yung mga previous situations natin, we have a community pantry, no? Anyone can can get whatever they want sa mga foods na nandoon, no? As long as they need it. Yung mga, yung unang, pala, uh, unang sabak, no? Yung last year, yung unang uh, bugso ng pandemya, unang isip, yung makikita nyo na po yung pakikipagkapatao ng ating mga kababayan Pilipino. Maraming na, na, nagbigay ng mga donations, yung iba dyan, hindi na naka-broadcast yan sa Facebook, pero nagbibigay at nagbibigay yan. Dahil nung unang, uh, nung January 2020, nung pumutok ang uh, Bultang Taal, nung nagkaroon ng problema sa Batangas, no? marami ang mga kababayan natin ang tumulong din, nagbigay ng donations sa ating mga uh, nangangailangan. So, ang pakipagkapatao, ang pagtulong sa kapwa, in a, so, in a different uh, races natin, makikita yan. No? We can help uh, strangers and kahit hindi natin kakilala, no? actually, mas, ma- mas maganda pang ang tulungan yung hindi mo kakilala kasi hindi yan ang hihingi ng kapalit. No? If you are a Samaritan, would you do the same? Gagawin ba natin yung ginawa ng, ng Samaritan na yan? So, justify your answer. So, my dear learners, walang mali sa ating isusulat. Yan sabi nga, 
we are to love others regardless of their race or religions um, the criterion is need if they need and we have the supply then we are to give generously and freely without expectations of return actually the the, the lessons of the parable of the good samaritans no, are threefold no? number one we are to set aside our prejudice and show love and compassion for others so that's the answer for the number one no? our neighbor is anyone we encounter we are all creators of the creators and we are to love all of mankind as jesus has taught us and keeping the law in its entirety with the intent to save ourselves is an impossible task we need the savior and this is jesus christ so pinakita lang ni jesus christ sa atin no kung paano ba ang tama ang pakikipagdapat tao okay so under subjectivity in general sabi nga the parable of the good samaritan clearly explains the phenomenon of intersubjectivity in the human world Though it focuses on the kingdom of God, it still varies the importance of intersubjective relations of man. Sabi nga, intersubjectivity is a coined word from the prefix inter, which connotes among and between, and the philosophical term subject that is equivalent to a conscious being. Thus, intersubjectivity would mean in the general sense as sharing of subjective states by two or more individuals. Ibig sabihin, ito yung pagbabahagi natin ng kung ano yung meron tayo, hindi lang sa isa, hindi sa dalawa o sa marami pa ang individual na tao. No? Kaya nga pag sinabi intersubjectivity, ang pinakamadaling uh, meaning po nito ay pakikipag kapwa tao. No? Meaning to say, as a person, we have a personal regard to self, but we cannot deny the fact, objective, no? the fact of reality we all share, that we live with others, so we also regard them as part of our self. We tend to place ourselves in others' shoes, and relate to them in good ways as possible. You know? So let's take a look for this uh, situation. No? Sabi dito sa caricature, sa comic strip na to, no? I'll call you when I get there. Sabi naman niya, okay, or just text message me, or email me, and dami na sinabi, or Skype me, or instant message me. Sabi naman nun na if only it weren't so convenient to be pa- a part of this case. Sabi nyo ba, actually just hug me. So, ang pakipagkapatao, no? hindi naman kailangan ng message-message, email, uh, Skype, or ganitong uh, uh, stream yard. No? Ang pakipagkapatao ay nakikita lang yung sa simpleng kalaanan. Yung pag, may, pag meron talaga na ilangan ng tulong, no? or may, ang, ang pagtulong ay hindi rin sa pinansyal na bagay. Kung ang kaibigan mo o ang kapa mo ay malaki ang problema ang pinagdadaanan, no? uh, nawala ng minamahal sa buhay, isang hug lang dyan, malaking tulong na yan. No? Ang pagyakap, ang pagtapik sa likod, no? Ang pagtapik sa balikat ay isang maganda uh, magaama, uh, isang paraan na para maipakita mo ang iyong pakikipagkapwa tao. So there are different means, no, to show your uh, pakikipagkapwa tao or intersubjectivity, no? Pwedeng through financial means if you have money, pwedeng in a simple way, no, kapag shared problema, pwedeng pagbibigay ng advice, no? So there are different ways on how to show your uh, relationship with others. So, what philosopher says about intersubjectivity? No? Sabi nga, number one si Confucius. Sabi nga, one of the main ideas of Confucianism is ren, or human-heartedness. This means Confucian thinking on intersubjectivity is practical humanism. Um, makata, makatao. No? There is an em- emphasis on human actions and so- uh, in sociality because every man to love the other through actions, not through thoughts. No? Si Confucianism, makatao to. No? Ang, ang, ang uh, filosofiya niya ay more on uh, humanism, practical humanism. Paano ka ba makikipagkapatao? Paano mo ba ipapakita yung pagmamahal mo sa kapatao mo? No? Sabi nga, uh, do unto others what do others do unto you. Know? So, isa yan sa mga golden rules ni Confucius. And then, another one is Martin Buber. Sabi niya, we have to treat another person as a subject, a being different from things or objects. Persons are not inanimate objects to be used. They have their own mind and free will. Yes, they have their own mind and free will. Thus, we have to respect others as we respect ourselves. I refers to the selves and thou or you refers to others. This I, thou, relationship is the most meaningful relationship in the realm of humanity. The I is the same with the thou, and there should be mutual relationship between them. So for Martin Buber, no, ang I refers to yourself, or thou or you refers to others. No? Kasi hindi naman pwedeng me, myself, and I. No? Kailangan 
uh, matutunan din natin yung me, myself, and others. Me and others. No, myself and others. Lagi dapat may others kasi hindi tayo pwede palagi me, myself, and others. Hindi pwede palagi ako ng ako ng ako or self ng self. Lagi din natin to consider yung kapwa natin because our others or ang ating kapwa, they have their own mind and free will then. And they, we need to respect them also. And, and respecting our uh, self means respecting our other person, no? yung mga kapwa natin. Kaya nga napakaganda ng mga filosofiya ni Confucius at ni Martin Buber kasi they are focusing on humanism o pagpaano nga ba ang tamang pagkipagkapatao o yung isa sa mga core values ng deped na makatao. Diba sabi makajos, makakaligasan at makabansa at makatao. No? Isa yan sa mga uh, core values ng deped. Uh, another philosopher is Carol Rotila. For Rotila, human actions is the foundation of our being. But human reality is also about being with others. So our actions are also directed towards others. No? Tama si Ms. Nansen, no? Confucius and Martin Luther. Martin Luther is also a humanism. No? For Rotila, human action is the foundation of our being. But human reality is also about being with others. So our actions are also directed towards others others, no? So, hindi lang siya palaging self, hindi others. Sabi nga, kagaya nga ng una kong sinabi sa slides, no? No man is an island. We cannot live alone. Kailangan natin ng ating kapwa. Kasi maghirap po magbuhay mag-isa. In times of pandemic, in times of crisis, kailangan natin ng ating kapwa. Sino ba ang magtutulungan kung hindi tayo-tayo lang, no? Ang ating mga kapitbahay. And there are different ways on showing our pakikipagkapatao. So, my dear learners, sa ating mga learners ngayon, no, isa lang ang uh, nais nice, uh, tukuyin ng ating lessons, no, ng lessons natin sa module na to, no, sa module 2 ng quarter 4. Ito ay ang paano ka nga ba makikipagkapatao sa iyong uh, neighbor, sa iyong kaklase, sa sa iyong uh, kasama sa bahay, kina mama, papa, sa iyong mga kapatid, no, paano mo ba ipapakita ito? Napakagabi ng ating modules, no, at wala pong mali sa ating mga uh, isasagot sa modules natin kasi ito ay naka-base lamang sa ating rubrics. So, how are you going to show uh, pakikipagkapatao or intersubjectivity no? to others? So, do you have any questions po? So, sino yung tatlong philosophers na yun? Si Confucius, si Martin Buber, si Carol Abotila. No? For them, ang, pag, uh, ang pakikipagkapatao uh, ay hindi lang nakafocus sa salili, kung hindi rin sa others, humanism, no? or makatao sila. Okay? So, do you have questions? Okay, if you don't have any questions, napakabili lang ng modules na ito, napakabilis lang niya. No? Sa, sa pivot modules natin, kung makikita ninyo, napakakonti lang ng lessons na ito. No? Konti lang din yung lectures. Kaya it's more on activity time, no? Sa mga activities natin doon, makikita lang doon, mayroong activity doon yung uh, paano yung pakikipagkapatao na tinutukoy ni Confucius, ni Martin Buber, and ni Carol Botina. And your answer is ito lang tatlong to, no? Yung for Confucius, yung Confucianism or human heartedness, the practical humanism. And for Martin Buber, yung idol, relationships. And for Carol Botina, is the human actions is the foundation of our so, it's always pertains to others, not I, me, myself, and I. Hindi po gano'n, no? Ang pakikipagkapatao. It's always me and others. Okay? I and others. I and you. I love you. Kaya nga, I love you. I and you. So, hindi pwede I love I. It's always I love you. It always pertains to other people or other person. Or we love you. Okay? So if you don't have any activity, uh, any questions, it's about for time for the quiz. Abilis lang ang lesson natin. Okay, number one, questions. Among the statements below, what best describes intersubjectivity? Is it A, intersubjectivity is about how humans treat plants? B. It is a state of sharing of subjective states by two or more individuals. Letter C. It is about how we judge other persons. Or letter D. We treat others as objects in intersubjective relationships. So what would be your answer? Okay. 
Sa niyo po ang inyong mga modules at nakikita niyo ito, yung assessment na ito. Okay, if your answer is letter B, that's correct. Okay, it, letter B, it is a state of sharing of subjective states by two or more individuals. Now, that is the best description of intersubjectivity. Okay. Okay, number two. Which statement is incorrect? Incorrect, okay, about intersubjectivity. Letter A. Love is an important aspect in intersubject in intersubjective relationships. Letter B, we can put ourselves in the shoes of others. Letter C, I can disregard others as much as I want. Or letter D, we cannot help but be sensitive with the existence of the others. Okay, so what will be your answer? Okay. If your answer is letter C, that's correct. Okay? I can disregard others as much as I want. Sabi nga ha, which statement is incorrect? No, yung mali about intersubjectivity. So the correct answer is letter C. I can disregard others as much as I want. Because yung A, B, and D, sabi, is important aspects in intersubjectivity, in pakikipagkapatao. Diba? Ang pagmamahal sa kapwa ay isa sa mga mahalagang aspeto ng intersubjectivity. Kasi paano ka makipagkapatao kung hindi mo naman mamahalin ang iyong kapwa? Kaya nga, I love you. Mahal na mahal mo ang iyong kapwa. At kailangan natin ang ating kapwa. Okay. Next, number three. Who among the discussed philosophers focus on the concept of human-heartedness in his philosophy of intersubjectivity? Is it A. Carol Watila B. Martin Buber C. Confucius or letter D. Martin Heidegger. Okay. If your answer is letter C, that's correct. No, Confucius. Okay. The correct answer is Confucius. Si Confucius ay isa sa mga uh, mahalagang uh, philosophers during the ancient times. No, Actually, mako, ma, mako, uh, may encounter niyo link ng Confucianism sa world religions. Na kasi isa sa mga tinatarakay sa world religion ang Confucianism. Next. Who is the Jewish philosopher who introduced the I thou and I it relationships? Okay, is it A. Carol Watila, B. Martin Buber, C. Confucius, or letter D. Martin Heidegger? If your answer is letter B, that's correct. No? Si Martin Buber. He is a Jewish philosopher. Okay. okay, number five. What is the main focus of Carol Wotila's philosophy of intersubjectivity? No? Ano yung focus ng kanyang philosophy of intersubjectivity? Is it A, intellect, B, feelings, C, participation, or letter D, contributions. Okay? If your answer is letter C, that's correct. Okay? So the answer is letter C, participation. Okay. Uh, sa mga learners po natin, okay? so nap, uh, napaka-konti lang talaga ng lessons natin sa pivot modules natin on intersubjectivity. It's more focusing on paano po tayo makikipagkapatao. At isa sa mga best uh, passage na, na binigay no, sa ating modules ay ang The Parable of the Good Samaritan. Sabi nga ni Jesus Christ, no, do uh, just follow what the Good Samaritan do. No? Uh, tumulong tayo sa kapwa natin uh, despite the race, religions, ano man ang dahin natin, ano man ang kulay natin, no? kayo mang giman tayo, maputi, or whatever may uh, mangi pinawala at ano man ang meron tayo no hindi hindi dapat iyon ang pasihan ng pakikipagkapatao no ang pakikipagkapatao ta uh, pakikipagkapatao ay walang pinipili na kahit na anong uh, races natin or religious or anything man no at the same time paano nga ba tayo makikipagkapatao sa mga may kapansanan isa na yun no uh, kailangan tulungan natin sila without asking any any return at hindi walang basis ng uh, bullying or any uh, ano yan, uh, walang uh, basis ng yung, yung talagang masasaktan mo sila ng even words, desensitive words sa ating mga uh, kapatid na 
may disability. Sa so, module kasi natin, sa may mga hawak ng mga learning materials, ang focus doon ay ang ating mga person with disability. Paano ka makikipagkapatao to those people who have disability? In our modules naman, hindi siya nakafocus sa, uh, sa may mga person with disability. Pero, sinasabi dito, in all races, in all kinds of, in all walks of life, we need to help our others, no? Ang ating kapwa. Kaya nga, hindi tayo magubuhay na mag-isa lang, no? Man is an island as the springboard in our module. Okay. If, uh, sino yung mga tatlong philosophers no? na sinasabi sa ating module? Si Confucius. Focusing on Confucianism, human heartedness, si Martin Buber sa I Love and I Eat Relationships, and si Carol Butila, focusing his philosophy on participation, na tayo ay dapat nagpa-participate, uh, hindi lang sa, sa lahat ng mga, sa lahat ng pwede tayo makipag-participate para mapakita natin ang ating pakikipag-hapwa-tao. Okay?